Hi, welcome to this video tutorial of Adroitech Engineering Solutions. This video is going to be giving you an idea on creating various view orientations of a 3D model in Creo Parametric. Considering I open an empty part model from an empty template, we see that there are no datum planes available and no default orientations available except, ex except the default orientation and standard orientation. So it is a compulsion to us to create even the default commonly used views in addition to other views. So let us see how we do it. So this is a cube which has got various views put on all the uh, sides for the sake of explanation purpose. Now let us see how to create various 3D orientations to this particular model. Go to the view tab, initiate manage views from the view or to initiate the view manager or it's also available in the quick access toolbar. We can use either of that. The view manager has got various tabs. Go to the orient tab available where you can create. Go for a new view, type a appropriate name of the view that you want to create and say redefine you can also select it by right click I say there are there are two references required for any view one is uh, front one is uh, front reference which is selected uh, in this example another one is the top reference say refit done so by selecting two references we have created a front view which is very obvious let us see how we create a back view you cannot edit it unless otherwise it has been activated so you will have to type the name enter so it gets activated now right click or go to edit redefine now in the reference method I say for the reference one I say I, I would not want to select my front reference I would want to select a different one how do we do that go to the reference method list I say I am going to select a back view of my orientation. I say my front plane is defining my back view and my top plane is defining my top reference that forms my back. Right? You see that the zoom status of both these created views are totally different. So it's always recommended to refit and save the view so that all views are at a uniform zoom state then I create a bottom view which is little different I'm going to the reference one this time I'm also going this time or as well I'm going to select a back reference my back reference will be my top plane because top plane backside is my bottom view right so I have selected back reference as my top plane and my top reference as my front plane you see that it has come exactly upside down so I select the second reference method make it to bottom reference and select the same front plane so my front plane is defining the bottom reference of my view got my actual thing right now go for a new one I'm going to create a customized view other than these top front right left so for this I would better prefer a dynamic orient method which has got options to pan and spin as well as zoom I can horizontally pan it vertically and zoom in or zoom out to reset the value just say refit then spin center if you don't see the spin center make sure you are switching it on like this on the x-axis angle of revolution on the x-axis of the spin center y-axis of the spin center and z-axis they are denoted by red green and cyan red x y green and cyan z 
You can also use the dynamic update option enabled or disabled as you need. The other option of spin is by the screen. Irrespective of the model's position, irrespective of the model's position, you can make a horizontal, vertical and a center rotate. Or you can also enter values in the respective dialog boxes. So now the orientation required is defined. Once the orientations are defined, you see that in the quick list, you automatically have all the views that we have created. The icons update automatically for the views like bottom, left, right, top, front, not the other views. Now let us see how we can reuse the same thing in the detail drawing. I'm going for a detail drawing using a default template. Let me remove all these views. I don't want it. I am inserting a general view. In the view type category, you have the views listed. Select the view you want to apply and say OK. The view gets applied. Hope this video was of use to you. Looking forward to have you again on a different video of Adroit Tech Engineering Solutions. For a detailed training, please contact mcad.support at adroitechinfo.com. Thank you. Have a nice day.